to another wonderful episode here, Jaws Podiatry. Just trying to mix it up a little bit here with our, you know, the content. Um, young patient who had uh, what we call hybrid minimally invasive uh, bilateral toe shortening, second toes. Uh, it's now been go going into six weeks. Into seven into the seventh week so we're in six week we're in week six, six right now we're going into the seventh week um so this particular patient young patient um very active patient was not happy with um two 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 issues function and beauty right uh function it was uncomfortable am i correct with the uh -huh. right um the tip of the toe hitting the front part of the shoe. And number two, the aesthetic element. So six weeks ago, we went ahead and performed the, the procedures, okay? Uh, in addition to that, we also did the toe tuck, right? The toe tuck uh, is a deep bulking of the adipose tissue, which is basically a, a plastic surgery technique where we actually, believe it or not, we we thin the toe just a little bit on the, on the tip of the toe to make it look pretty. Patients that have this Morton's type toe, the Morton's toe, the long second toe, they have this, this little pouch, and I've said it before, a little pouch. And that pouch, if you shorten the toe, the pouch looks like um, it doesn't look good. It actually makes the toe look uglier. Let's take a look. So, so what I've done here is I've drawn the parabola, right? And I've drawn what the, where, where and, and the, the patient can attest that her toe was basically out to here. Am I correct? Mm -hmm. Approximately. She had a very, very long toe. And again, what we're looking for is that normal, you know, that really nice parabola. Come from the top here, Caesar. So people can really, there you go. Appreciate when we, you know, when we look at the symmetry, we're looking at that. That's that's where the that's where the uh, you, know, you can't teach this type of experience. Honestly, this is same thing goes for the left. Okay. Now the toe again. We look at the parabola. Toe was out to here. Uh, the toes are still swollen. Okay. Believe it or not. Uh, yes, and they're going to be swollen for a very long time. You guys see the toe thinner here than here. It's because we're using something, we're using this, okay? This is called Coban, and basically, um, this is for edema control. Toes, and the reason why, just in general, foot surgery, they're um, where a lot of people come, oh, you know, it's been six months and I still have like all this swelling. It doesn't matter if it's minimally invasive or the open traditional. It's our biggest limiting factor because we don't walk on our hands. We walk on our feet. And the person standing for so many, you know, for such a long time, all that swelling just drains down to the toes. So we're using this to eliminate, right? We're using this, this uh, the coban. We wrap the toes to drain, right? To push all that out. That's why you guys see it here. Probably kinked a little bit here. That's why you see the little crease. Uh, but all in all, the toes look absolutely beautiful. They really do. Um, and and again, seven weeks. You know, you can't even see. You know, these when, when I, you know when we talk about the hybrid approach. Um, in this particular case, you can't even see. She, you know, the incisions. You know, they were like two. You know, two stitches on. You know, on uh, on on each incision. Two sutures on each. Look at this. You can't even see anything. Guys, we're not, you know, you know, you can't, you can't see anything. It looks beautiful, beautiful. Now, I'll ask the patient, how has it been for you? Very what has good. been, what, what has been the hardest part of this entire process? For people out there to know, what's been the hardest? Mm, maybe, um, Aside from the limitation of activity. Of, of activity, yeah, because I'm not very active exercising person but no actually i could walk since the first day maybe walking for a long period which actually not that bad 
no. Okay. Are you no. silly question? Are you happy that you? I'm very happy, super okay. happy. I thought it was going to be like worse that I had to be like. Oh, the most important thing, you know, down. right? Oh, and yeah, like static, but no, nothing. The most important part, or just in general, in any surgery, is there's got to be a really, really, uh, in respect to communication, there's got to be, you know, it, the communication needs to be meant from the beginning to the end. Uh, realistic expectations, right? Mm -hmm. That's important because we want to uh, under promise and then over deliver, right? Uh, and, and you know, when I tell patients it's going to be six weeks and you're going to have swelling of the toes up to six months or even more, that's what we do. We don't say, oh, yeah, you're going to be, you know, wearing your your Louboutinis, right? Or whatever, or the, the, your, your Gucci's uh, high heels in a month. That's not what we do, right? I just started using uh, sneakers like one week ago. There you go. But the patient knew that. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> right. This is an investment, ladies and gentlemen. More ladies and gentlemen. As always, www.gilespodiatry.com, Instagram, Dr. Toe Jam, Giles Podiatry, Facebook, and last but not least, our YouTube channel, Giles Healthcare. Minimally invasive toe shortening surgery. In respect to communication, there's got to be, you know, it, the communication needs to be meant from the beginning to the end. Uh, realistic expectations, right? Mm -hmm. That's important because we want to uh, under promise and then over deliver, right? Uh, and, and, you know, when I tell patients it's going to be six weeks and you're going to have swelling of the toes up to six months or even more, that's what we do. We don't say, oh yeah, you're going to be, you know, wearing your, your Louboutinis, right? Or whatever, or the, the, your, your Gucci's uh, high heels in a month. That's not what we do, right? I just started using uh, sneakers like one week ago. There you go. But the patient knew that. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> right. This is an investment, ladies and gentlemen. More ladies and gentlemen. As always, www.gilespodiatry.com, Instagram, Dr. Toe Jam, Giles Podiatry, Facebook, and last but not least, our YouTube channel, Giles Healthcare. Minimally invasive toe shortening surgery. It does it. <laughs>